How's it going, guys? Tactics HD here, bringing you some new NHL 15 news. Starting off, guys, me showing you all the pre-order offers for NHL 15. So, as you guys can see, the first pre-order offer here is Amazon.com, $15 value of Hockey Ultimate Team content, and that's the same across the board aside from GameStop. So, as you guys can see, Best Buy also offering $15 value of Hockey Ultimate Team content. GameStop is actually offering $24 value of Hockey Ultimate Team content, so you're getting an extra $9 of content just for pre-ordering at either GameStop if you're American or EB Games if you're Canadian. Target, like I was saying, also $15 of value, and lastly, Walmart also gives you $15 value for pre-ordering. And also, guys, as you can see, if you didn't already know, the release date in North America is September 9th, 2014. And as you guys can see, right here is a quick look at NHL 15 with the exclusive, exclusive bonus on ebgames.com. It's $69.99, a bit expensive, but uh, the next-gen titles are. And as you guys can see uh, below the game there, it says $24 of hut uh content so um right here guys is a look at the description for the bonus it says you know pre NHL 15 received the 24 dollar value of hockey team content and uh amongst that big paragraph there guys it says how you have to redeem the pack by september september 16th in order to get all 24 gold packs that's what you're getting for the 24 dollar value it's 24 gold packs and they're just these standard gold packs i believe the 6250 ones and uh, the reason you have to redeem it by september 16th that's a week after the game comes out and what happens if basically you don't redeem your pack within the week the new pack will come in and you don't have two packs in your in your store anymore. You only have one. So you got to make sure you're always redeeming pack each week. And as you guys can see, it actually says each gold pack contains 12 ultimate team items, most gold items opposed to all gold, which kind of sucks, and a mix of players, training, and consumable items. So like I was saying, most likely going to be similar to these 6,250 packs we know of. And uh, right here, guys, something really cool. This is actually the NHL 15 Ultimate Edition. They didn't do this for NHL 14, but they did have the Stanley Cup Edition in NHL 14. And as you guys can see, the Ultimate Edition is only $10 more than the regular game. So for an extra 10 bucks, I was probably going to buy it no matter what. And I decided to look at the description, and I mean, it's definitely worth it for the 10 bucks. Uh, the second paragraph, guys, you guys can see, kickstart your Hockey Ultimate Team with NHL 15 Ultimate Edition with over $40 of added exclusive content. You'll have everything you need to dominate the hockey world. So basically, you pay the extra 10 bucks when you pre-order to get the Ultimate Edition, and you get over $40 of added value of exclusive content. Most likely going to be a mixture of Halt Hockey Ultimate Team content, probably some EASHL stuff, and uh, maybe they'll do some like NHL.com deal. I actually still have my NHL 13 Stanley Cup Edition, guys, so I decided I'd read off what I got from Stanley Cup Edition NHL 13 uh, to kind of show you guys what you might be getting in NHL 14 Ultimate Team Edition. So um, you got the two packs in the Stanley Cup Edition with the Western Conference and Eastern Conference champions. If you guys don't know, you got uh, an LA pack and a New Jersey pack. Each pack had like those Stanley Cup cards. Uh, you also got a gold jumbo pack con consisting of a Wayne Gretzky legend, so a lot of people had Wayne Gretzky in NHL 13 for that reason. You also got a CCM boost pack featuring all the new CCM RBZ hockey stick, and then you also got a 10% discount on a one-time purchase at NHL.com. So, pretty good value. I think the Stanley Cup Edition was actually 20 bucks more, and I don't even think that was $40 of value, so uh, the Ultimate Team Edition is only 10 bucks more, and it sounds like you're probably going to get more bang for your buck, which, you know, makes it definitely worth it. Also, guys, I see on NHL, on, uh, sorry, on, on NHL.com, on IGN.com, they actually released the European release date. The European release date is September 12th, and so a few days after the North American one, the North American is obviously um, going to be September 9th, which will be the Tuesday, and then the uh, NHL 15 comes out in Europe on the Friday, September 12th. So Europeans have to wait a few extra days, but at least you guys know now when you're getting the game. So anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. It really helps me out. Also, guys, in the outro, there will be a link to my NHL 15 first gameplay trailer breakdown. Make sure you guys check that out. Besides that, guys, thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Stay tuned for more. Goodbye. It's the kind of beat the gold.